Good afternoon. Slack is back. Master Butcher. We're going to get the right side up today. Biting to British. We're supporting British farmers, British butchers, British slaughterhouses. Everything that's the best of British. We're on it today. Slack is on. So, beef today. We're going to do Jewish fillet or a bullet steak. Jewish fillet or a bullet steak. One of the reasons Jewish fillet, Jewish fillet, because the Jews in kosher don't eat the high quarter of a beef, they only eat the four quarter. And it's the their piece of fillet that comes out. We call it a bullet steak. Either way, it's very nice. So it's a Simmental Cross Hereford Heifer. Again, Hereford meat, the best. Now let's have her off. She's a big one. So let's have a sneaky peek, lot. The eye of the ribeye. Stunning, beautiful. Enough covering on that for me, I'm afraid. So to get to what we're going to get to, we need to, the Jewish fit is about, it's about here. It's the bit that we need to get to. So, first things first, sports vans, sharp knife. Slack his knife, sharp knife, keep chopping the fingers off. Shin. We've done this before, three or four times, and removed the shin. Find the area, the joint. Break it off, just like that. We're going to do one mass barbecue. Autumn's coming, well she's here now. It's still warm out there, so there's enough time for a good barbecue. So we're going to barbecue the Jewish filling. So next thing, when you find this, this knot here, this is the knuckle here. I'm going to push it across. Pull it across. And that. We'll go through the neck. It breaks. Just like that. That's how we want it. Just like that. Neck. That's for autumn again. Winter. Spent slow cookers are on. Next week, we're all about the slow cookers. This week, we're still barbecuing. So this is the Jewish filling. This is the bit we want here, look. Can you see this muscle here? That is the Jewish fillet. That is the bullet stave. So if we can get it out, it is a seam, so we can seam it out without taking any more off. It'll make life a lot easier. We'll take the shin off and we'll do it properly. We'll not bodge it. We're going to take it anyway. So shin off. Find the joints, remove the joint, remove the shin. Beautiful. We don't need that today either. This is the part we're needing. So we're going to go back to just removing this lump here down the seam when it pulls away. It is a bit awkward to get to like this, but I'm sure a master butcher with my capability can get it out. You can see that there, that's the knuckle, that's the shoulder blade there, so the, we need to be under that to the next shoulder blade. So it's the muscle that holds the shoulders together. And it should just pop out. You see the seam just down there, we just follow that seam just like that. This is the Jewish fillet. We'll just trim it up. Just trim it up like that. One Jewish fillet. So what we're gonna to do tomorrow, we're gonna to barbecue this. Us English, we braise it. We use it as a braising steak. It doesn't need braising, it's very soft. The best thing to remove to do it is we'll take a bit of this skin off the top of the beast. This lovely fat, this lovely marbling, that's what we need, this, all this flavour, goodness. Remove that like that. And what we're going to do is we're going to wrap it in it. We're going to wrap it in like that, though. So we'll wrap this, this 
the skin and the fat around the Jewish filet. It's gonna keep it soft, it's gonna keep it moist. And tomorrow we're gonna to put that in the barbecue for you. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Jewish fillet or bullet steak.